It has been three months since Mineplex shut down. Yeah, it's been three months, and I'll make this video just to talk about what I've been doing in the last couple of months in terms of content. And you can think there's like an update video or not, because I'm not really updating, it's just what I've been doing, how I've been feeling about Mineplex closing down, the updates that have been going out with Mineplex, I am keeping up with their Discord, and I want to talk about that in today's video. If you don't know, if you're new to my channel, I've been a part of Mineplex in the community since 2014. Essentially nine years now, eight, nine years, I believe. It's close to a decade. And, um, yeah, when the server first shut down, I said in my initial video, I remember, I said I was relieved. Because making Mineplex videos kind of sucked because no one was online. But a rabbit hole I sort of am I'm in now is that, well, I, I use Mineplex as content for videos. And without Mineplex, I sort of don't have a server to just record a video on. So I feel more like it's difficult to make videos now because I don't have those days where I can just go, okay, I'll just go Mineplex, record a game. You know, come up, come up with something, whether it be a paintball episode or Super Smash Mobs. Also, are you, are you enjoying Super Smash Mobs gameplay? That's from like 2021, I believe, something along those lines. But um, I can play that game or I can play any game that was on that had players on. Because there are games I did like, even in the final years of Mineplex, like Nano Games, I did enjoy, which is just easy content to make. And uh, I, I, I did that to kind of put content on the channel so I can focus on more bigger-ish videos. But without that, I'm kind of struggling. I'm like, okay, there are days where I just can't upload anything. I don't know what to record. Because Mineplex doesn't, you know, it's not op open anymore. So I'm like, what do I do? <laughs> you know, I can't record on Hypixel. I mean, I could. But I mean, I don't really like playing games on Hypixel. <laughs> you know? So I mean, I'm kind of in this rabbit hole where I'm like, what do I do? Now I find creative ways. Late films gave me an idea for a you know a series I've been doing on this channel. You may have seen the videos already, where it's like I survive with Netherite armor to complete every advancement. And it's a pretty fun series. I have a lot of ideas for that. I'm still continuing it, and I still like it. But I can't get an entire channel of that. When you know I have Fortnite, but Mineplex really was like had a place. I, I, that was like the first video I ever recorded. You know. And so, having that gone is sort of history being removed. But there is hope, because Sammy TOD bought Mineplex, and he's doing stuff. And like that, I've been keeping track of the Discord, and a lot of people are kind of getting restless right now when it comes to updates, because there is no updates. And Sammy TOD actually did say that, you know, he's one of those type of people that don't doesn't like to reveal stuff until it's actually ready, which I do respect that. And I don't know if I said this before, but like, about this, but that's what he does, and so there's basically no updates on the server for like, a good month, maybe two months, I don't know, actually it's been a month. <laughs> which isn't good, but at the same time, I'm not a business person, I don't know what it takes to get Microsoft, get your server back on the featured list or whatever happened there. To build a server it takes a lot of money, resources, people, trust again. Because Mineplex, the thing about Mineplex is that it's a very difficult server to get back running again, regardless if it was still open or not, because people don't trust the server anymore. The why would they? The server only had like 50 people on it. You know, why invest money into it if it's not going to work out? You know, a lot of people in the world are half glass empty type of people. They're not going to invest or even youtubers are not going to record a video on something that is not going to guarantee success initially and i've seen it before with other servers which it sucks when it comes to content creation if a server doesn't seem right to record on or too risky because it may hurt their channel they're just not going to people are not going to record on the channel anymore that's why people left mineplex in terms of content wise because you know it's not worth it. Your channel's dying because of it. I mean, I didn't, because I, st I kept on it, and, you know, I have videos that have a couple hundred views, which on my place which I'm really happy about. I feel like I should talk about how I feel about all of this, because, like, now, because, like I said before, earlier in the video, I talked about how I felt relieved that Mineplex is, you know, closed, because making Mineplex videos, like I said, sucked. Now, you know, I am sad, <laughs> you know, that realization that the server that you've been on for the past eight 
to nine years since 2014 is gone and you don't really have a place to kind of just chill up because besides making mindplex videos i did chill out in lobby one in, in mindplex lobby a lot just you know whether i'm eating dinner or just want to chill out you know it's a little time waster to go on the server see what people are doing see what people are typing you know they're hacking the lobby you know that that type of stuff it interests me and that's gone and it sucks and I think a very reassuring thing that I've been doing is that I have a playlist on my original channel, the Keith channel, where I have a playlist called Mindplex Through the Years, where I chronologically add every Mindplex video that I think is important and that is actually watchable in the playlist. And this goes beyond Mindplex, basically anything that the owners have been involved in beforehand, that's in there a little bit. And it starts all the way back in 2011 to now in 2023. You know, with with the closure of Mindplex, I think it's really reassuring, and has I feel like an archaeologist discovering the past, finding these past relics, whether they're good or bad. I put them in there. Viewer discretion is advised because a lot of inappropriate stuff, because because it spans all the way back in 2011, and YouTube was really different back then. So, yeah, viewer discretion is advised. If you want to go check that out, I really have fun making it. I'm still doing it like mostly every day. Granted, I may stop. I don't know when I'm going to stop, but I do like that. And it has given me that reinsurance that Mindplex isn't going away because it shows a lot of people play it on the server and a lot of people care about it. And whenever Mindplex is going to get an update again from CMTOD or it's going to be released, a lot of people are going to really like the server and play on it because a lot of people have a lot of memories on it. And the videos I've been watching, you know, all the videos I've been collecting really show that Mineplex is, you know, it, one, it shows the downfall of Mineplex, I think it's very interesting. You get to see people's attitudes slowly shift over time. Two, you do get to see the enjoyment and happiness people have, even in modern years, you know, the more recent years. There are videos that are just people playing the server in. That's great. With that being said, I think it's time to wrap things up here. Um... Yeah, Mindplex is, uh, yeah, maybe closed down, but the memories I've had with the server and also doing my playlist of adding, like, oh, like a lot of videos on there has really kind of shaped how I view Mindplex and kind of been interested with the future of the server because, you know, it's all the past and the, pr and the future and the present, you know, all this stuff. Like, what's the server going to do now? Because what I've learned is that Mindplex is extremely unpredictable and what they're going to do so only time will tell but if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you hit the like button subscribe and the go now so goodbye everyone